Okay, let's have a look in the motorhome. Just have a quick look round. Now, remember this is only six metres long, but with the drop down bed configuration, it gives the impression, or it is as big in the lounge area as motorhomes in excess of seven and a half metres. The lounge in particular is very sociable, loads of space, and this table configuration works very well. It can be swivelled all the way around. Like so. Well, I'm hoping that picks it up good. It will slide backwards, sideways, any which way you want to turn it. So you can have it in that way. Or that way. And as you can see, push front to back and side to side and then if we look at the kitchen you can see it's uh, an L-shaped kitchen loads of workspace oven grill three gas burners on the hob Stainless steel sink. And Dometic fridge freezer. Really is a good design. And as you can see, plenty of cupboard space above and below. And then if we swing around to the right, we've got the large wardrobe door. With the hanging rail. The door to the bottom is access to the boiler and then we've got the side washroom again really well designed Fetford bench flush toilet the sink moves out of position so that the shower door can separate the toilet from the shower so it does make itself into a separate cubicle if you like um, if you notice the tap there, the tap has been uh, repaired, but it will be replaced. Now it is billed as a four berth, um, but it really is a luxury two berth. The two extra bunks below the pull down bed are made up from the table and the, and the settees, but it's not something you want to be doing often. It's great to have the kids along now and again, but the pull down bed works like this. To pull down the bed, you just press in the handle at the top, pull it down. There is a ladder to uh, fit to the side. And for, for a drop down bed, it is quite spacious. And with the sides not enclosed, there's no feeling of claustrophobia. And it's a comfortable memory foam mattress. So there you can see the bed in its position. And then you can visualize i'm not going to put the bottom bed together but you can see that it's plenty of space under there and, and, and for kids it'll be fantastic a little den for them really there's the uh, control panel and it is heated with um, blown air and there's the controls for the hot water and blown air very simple system to use it also comes with two leisure batteries which are under the side seat there. The water tank is under this seat and it also has a solar panel. Right, so let's look at the cab itself. So I just slide the table like this and then we can access the cab quite easily. It's got a reversing camera, cab aircon, cruise control, it has got uh, Bluetooth connectivity, obviously electric windows and mirrors. Remis windscreen blinds to the obviously the windscreen and cab windows. Altogether, very tidy motor home. Just over 36,000 miles on the clock. It's in an excellent condition as you can see. Nothing needs doing. It's just ready for you to take it away on its next adventure. 
one of the best looking design, undesigned compact six meter for birth motor homes you'll find.